Hello beautiful soul. So I hope you all are doing well. I'm Anita Svetlana. Welcome to your reading. So this reading is going to be on messages from the spirit, spirit guidance. Okay. So as usual, we have three groups. You can see three images on your screen. The image to your left is group one. The image to your center is group two. And the image to your right is group three. So go ahead. Think about the guidance that you require and choose an image or a group that you're most drawn to. Please remember that this is a general collective reading. So please pick up messages that you resonate to. Don't forget to like, comment and consider subscribing as well. I mentioned the timestamps in the description. So all you need to do is choose an image or a group that you're drawn to. Go to the description. There's a timestamp mentioned against each group. If you click on the timestamp, that will take you directly to your reading. All right. Welcome group one. Let's look at your cards. Lost in space. Closing door. Drifter. Eye of the Needle. Okay. Uh, you know, you have been doing too much and, you know, you are feeling lost and you you need uh, a direction and you need to focus. And uh, you have been doing so much, you know, uh, that you find... 24 hours too short to finish your task okay and uh, you, some of you might be just very tired you need to regroup yourself you need to rest and and uh, regroup yourself because right now you're unable to focus or you're unable to decide what should be your next step you know just take one day at a time it's important for you to you know, take one day at a time right now and uh, do some grounding exercise so that you feel grounded, so that you can manage things that are happening in your life. And uh, don't get swallowed in this vast, you know, there are a lot of things happening in your life. So there's this, at times you feel this vast darkness around you. So don't get lost in that, you know, and it's like you are in this constant never ending work. So find your energy. At times you have absolutely no energy also. So find your energy and find your focus so that, you know, all is because all is not lost and keep it simple. Like I said, take one day at a time. Keep it simple. Take care of yourself, your well-being and everything will be fine. And most of you are so, uh, so emotional right now. And these are all unexpressed emotions because you're not able to because of what is happening around you, uh, it's been, uh, you can't believe what is happening around you. So, you know, you don't know exactly what to say and what to feel. But remember, you it is safe for you to speak your truth. So, express your emotions. Okay? And it's time to close doors which are not working for you. Okay? You feel as if you are, you know, locked and trapped in a cage. But no, it's not that. It's time for you to shut down uh, doors. Close doors, you know, might be end or a relationship or a job or any situation that you have been dragging to too far. Okay. It's time for you to unlock that cage that you've been trapped in and shut that door behind you. It is... This is not the time to, you know, worry about what others will feel, what others will think. Think about yourself. Think about how you feel and be true to your heart's calling. Walk out that door, you know. And you know, at times what we do is we keep knocking on a door which is not opening. And if that door has not been answered, take that as an answer and move on. Okay. Don't, uh, you know, don't let that pain consume you. Some of you knew that it was time to move on long time back. So move on. You have a greater calling. 
be grateful for the lessons that that you have learned and you know he because there is a lot of positive transformation that is occurring uh, you know at us on a soul level for you so so heal and set yourself free and in case you have a question in mind you know the answer is yes and you are not going to find the the answers that you are looking for on the shore it is time for you to do what lights you up it is time for you to you know experience life as it comes you know it is time for you to step out of your ordinary routine it is about you know uh, when you tie the ship to the moor okay you are not going to enjoy that it is time for you to cut the mooring line that is holding you to the dock and and move you need to set sail and you need to flow because when you get in the flow things will get clearer for you it's time for you to leave you know you feel that you are lost you know it's time your true compass is within yourself you will get back and you will find the direction okay so set intention set a clear intention about what is it that you would like to do okay and don't let your laziness come in your way and just move go with the flow okay don't let your mind wander you know gather yourself gather yourself and go with the flow okay you will find what you're looking for you know you will find the clarity that you're looking for you will there will be positive outcomes uh, to your situation and you will have a lot of positive outcomes and uh, see when you look at a needle what is it what is a needle needle is very tiny but uh, when you thread your intention through the eye of the needle imagine what all you can sew you can you can put together your your beautiful dreams you can put together something that is new and meaningful you know you will experience the success you need to stay true to your desires you need to work and put in the effort so that you will be able to accomplish whatever you desire have that laser focus uh, attention uh, like to thread a needle you need to be completely focused on the eye of the needle right so thread your intention you know stay focused and thread your intention and you know the divine forces are with you you do have a lot of magic that is there around you 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 do have a lot of blessings that are going to get showered on you okay uh, there is you are going through a transformation and this is going to be a, a blessing in in disguise that is going to come come your way and all you need to do is keep an open heart and mind keep an open heart and mind and be open to receiving everything that is coming your way all right let's look at your spirit cards can you feel me your feminine aspect is awakening feel the goddess energy inside you she seeks acknowledgement and validation new energies inside and opportunities are emerging wake up embrace and celebrate reflection so sorry reflect upon bless and be be grateful for all the beautiful times in your life give thanks for the many blessings you receive each day <clears throat> you can connect energetically to those you love simply feel them inside your heart life is beautiful the journey you are soaring to new heights experiment play allow your spirit the freedom to explore new and exciting possibilities for your life follow the rainbow across the horizon a pot of gold awaits okay conning enjoy the journey of life be not afraid of its mysteries take a chance and follow your heart you are guided and protected by konin goddess of mercy compassion and transformation if you have been wavering about proceeding with something that is dear to you then this is your confirmation just do it all right 
So, and I, I did say, you know, uh, in case you have a question, your answer is yes. Okay, so that's all I have for you, group one. I hope you resonated to the reading and the messages. And I will see you next time for your next reading. Thank you. Welcome group two. Let's look at your cards. Empty well. Dust devil. Mindful. And watcher. You know, uh, you have been doing too much and uh, it's time to fill your cup. It's time to replenish yourself. And, uh, you know, you have just been giving, 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 giving. Now you don't have any more energy to give, nor do you have anything to give. Okay. You need to be grateful for all the abundance that uh, you have experienced. And you need to allow the spirit to guide you. Okay. Even if it means leaving people or things behind, leaving things that don't serve you any purpose behind. And, you know, stop pleasing people. Stop pleasing people. Stop making yourself small just to keep other people happy. You know, you, you making yourself small is not going to change the situation. And... There always has to be an equal give and take. But with you, with you, it's only give, give and give. And it's time for you to reclaim what is yours. It is time for you to stand in your power. It's time for you to let go of everything that doesn't, you know, serve you any purpose. You don't need to react. You don't need to respond to other people because that's not real it's time for you to shine light upon upon your you know upon your situation it is time for you to shine yourself also but before that you need to get out of the situation okay you have you know spent and wasted so much of energy behind uh, behind other people it's time to spend time on yourself it's time for you to find yourself okay and you have been in this in this stagnant energy for a very long time. You need there's a lot of chaos that's happening in your life. It's time for you to embrace the chaos. It's time for you to move out of that stagnant energy, and uh, you know, you need to trust the process. You need to trust the spirit. You need to trust the divine. You know everything is happening at uh, you know as per everything is unfolding as per divine time. It's time for you to, uh, you know, unshackle yourself. It is time for you to leave your shackles behind. You have been chained, chained to your situation for a very long time. You know, you want everything to be perfect. You know, it's, it's, it is okay when things are not perfect. You know, Ex, uh, you know, you need to accept the, uh, the chaos. You need to accept the, the, the messy things that, that, uh, that are. You need to accept it the way if it is awkward but you know you should trust the process because that the minute you trust the process that the shift will happen you know the divine knows what you need and when you need it remember once the dust settled you'll be able to see the gift you'll be able to see you know the blessings that are being waiting for you don't let other people uh, you know influence your mind don't let uh don't don't let them influence your thoughts okay and you need to keep a clear head don't have hurtful thoughts or you know be very mindful about your thoughts because your thoughts create your reality uh ensure that you know uh you have only positive thoughts in your mind so be careful where you let your mind wander don't get influenced by others. Also, you know, we, we live in a digital age. So don't get influenced by everything that you see on the social media. 
okay let go of all your fears and uncertainty don't let them pollute your mind and your emotions okay stay out of gossip don't stay away from gossip stay away from drama okay fill yourself with thoughts of you know positive fill yourself with positive thoughts and keep the faith remember good always brings more good love brings more love gratitude will will bring you more things that uh, to be grateful for and and you need to heal your situation you need you know give love to your situation because that will heal the situation it will heal your present situation you need to be honest with yourself you need to find out what is it that you truly desire it's time for you to speak your truth also and speak your truth clearly with love and compassion and speak it from a place of love you need to follow your instinct you need to follow your intuition because what you're doing is you're making your current situation more complicated than it needs to be allow the spirit to guide you trust the divine remember that you are safe and you are safe always and uh, you know the universe always talks to us in messages so you must be re receiving uh, a lot of guidance and uh, you know a lot of messages from the divine you must be uh, seeing multiple uh, like you know uh, angel numbers butterflies so the angels are talking to you the divine is talking to you so be mindful and be aware about the messages that you are receiving the guidance that you are uh, receiving okay uh, it is time it take a step back and review you know uh, reflect upon what is it that you need to do and whatever guidance that you get keep it to yourself you don't need to share it you know with the whole world and observe observe things okay observe things that are happening all around you you know things will unfold naturally and because you have been trying uh, since a very long time to correct all the things that have been uh, been happening let it be for now and just observe okay and remember the the divine will give you the strength and the guidance to rise and be aware of uh, the divine coincidences that are happening the serendipity that is happening and uh, things will unfold naturally in a mysterious way you just need to believe and you need to have that faith and uh, remember like i said in the beginning it's time for you to shine that light it's it's time to shine your inner light okay and that inner light will shine when you are at peace with yourself and you are at peace with the world and the situation around you you need to let go of the struggle you need things you know let go of the uh, struggle you need to feel that beauty and that peace within you and allow everything to just be and you also just be yourself just be you okay remember that you have this infinite power within you you have this divine blessing within you you can create anything that you set your mind on you are one with the spirit and one with the universe and there is this eternal light that that shines through you so never forget that all right let's look at your other cards Okay, emotional breakthrough, emotional, emotional transformation, release, freedom. It is safe for you to express how you feel. Let it all out. Relationship deepens as a result. Moon goddess. So work with the energies of the moon. A time of unnecessary upheaval, a blessing in disguise. As the dust settles, the gift reveals itself, and that is what the dust devil does. you know it will move you out of the stagnant energy once the dust settles a place beyond time so don't get caught up with the everyday drama of life and i also just told you sometime back stay away from drama don't get involved with drama 
So don't caught up, get caught up with the everyday drama of life. Close your eyes, focus on your breath and allow it to carry you inside, uh, carry you into a peaceful space inside your heart. An eternal place beyond time filled only with love. Divine will. Everything happens as per divine will. Your life is unfolding in accordance with the divine will of your soul. Trust, let go of fear and apprehension. You are protected and eternally blessed. Have patience. All manifest in perfect timing. All right. So that's all I have for you, group two. I hope you resonated to the reading and the messages. And I will see you next time for your next reading. Thank you. Welcome group three. Let's look at your cards. Deep quiet. Dragon's horde. Drifter. And wood vibes. So it's time for you to take a step back and uh, you know, it's time for you to meditate. It's time for you to be still because that is going to give you a lot of clarity. And uh, it is time for you to, you know, still yourself and gather yourself, slow down, take a deep breath and go to a place, go within yourself to your heart center. Okay, listen to the guidance that the spirit wants to give you. Okay, trust your intuition. And just be there, okay? You will get the guidance that you're looking for. You will get the clarity that you're looking for, okay? And, you know, it's it's time for you to protect your future. The guidance that you get, don't share that with anybody. Protect your future, protect your legacy, protect your dreams, don't share your dreams with, with, with the whole world. Also, uh, be very mindful, you know, remember that everything that glitters is not gold and it's time for you to be your true authentic self. It, it is time for you to, you know, uh, let go of that masks that you're wearing. Avoid people that are not real, avoid things that are not real and true, okay? And like I said, don't share your dreams with anybody, protect your dreams. You know, because you will be able to only once when your dreams are, you know, very close to once your dreams are come to fruition, share it with people, share your success with people. OK, stay grounded, stay in the moment. OK, this is a time for you to be bold. Don't delay any decisions. Don't overthink because you are you will be offered you know, one of the best opportunity. So you need to believe that. And don't forget to say a prayer, okay? Uh, also, uh, it's time, you're not going to experience life, you know, uh, at the shore. It's time for you to leave the shore. It's time for you to do what lights you up, you know? What is it that you're seeking? It's time for you to follow your calling. It's time for you to follow the wind. And you need to explore your life and the opportunity that, that life is being uh, presenting to you. Okay. So, you know, it's time for you to cut that mooring line that is holding you back and, and, and go with the flow. You know, if you feel that, oh, I don't know where to go, you don't have to worry. You need to trust the spirit because you will be guided. The spirit is going to be your compass. Now, just believe. Just have, just believe and trust the spirit. Trust the divine. Okay. And don't, don't let your laziness get in, in, in your way. Okay, because life is going to bring you everything that you require, everything that you've been searching for. All you need to do is say yes, gather yourself and go with the flow. Release everything that is holding you back. 
okay you will find everything that you have been seeking for and be uh, adaptable you know uh, be grounded no matter what happens be grounded you need to know who you are you need to know uh, you know what are your boundaries you need to to, to set boundaries uh, that will make you feel good about yourself you need to know who you are and you need to know what you will tolerate and what you will not tolerate okay you need to also show people who you are that's the reason you need to stand in your power. But stay grounded. You will have everything that you need. You will have everything that it takes to, to do things right. Okay. But remind, remember to be flexible. Okay. Things will play out well for you. But be flexible. Be grounded. You know. Let go of everything that holds you back. And don't worry, you know, you will be, you will be presented with a new opportunity, something new. Just take that leap of faith. Don't have that fear. Stay, stay, stay rooted, stay in your integrity. Be in your true authentic self. Okay. And go for it. Okay. Because you are entering a time of great blessing you're entering a time of great love and peace be patient and allow everything to just settle okay you are uh, going to have a amazing future uh, you will be showered with blessings and uh, there will be you know uh, there will be a time when, when when you will finally realize that yes whatever you believe even if you believe in the impossible that will come to fruition okay let's look at your other cards forgiveness time to heal old wounds time to let go and forgive do not allow yourself to be your victim any longer for in doing so, you only you only hurt yourself. Forgive and set yourself free. You are eternally loved. Accept the love being offered and allow it to heal you. Honesty. This is what I spoke about. You need to be your true self. Okay. You need to be honest with yourself and and with people around you. You need to be honest about the situation also. So love, compassion, and truth will heal the present situation. Be honest with yourself. Discover what is it that you truly desire. Then speak your truth clearly. Always speak with love and compassion. And know that the truth will never harm anyone when spoken from a place of love. Can you feel me? Your feminine aspect is awakening. Feel the goddess energy inside you. Uh, she seeks acknowledgement and validation. New energies, insights and opportunities are emerging. Wake up, embrace and celebrate. Messages from afar. So messages are coming from afar. Expect positive and refreshing news. Uh, a great outcome for all. Alright. So that's all I have for you group 3. I hope you resonated to the reading and the messages. And I will see you next time for your next reading. Thank you.